What the fuck? That was interesting. If I can talk to her real quick. Appreciate if you found a way to open the cage. Uh. Well, I guess he can't die as long as I don't reveal him. That is weird. I wonder why that happens. That's very weird. wonder if I can neutralize poison on him so he can't die. That's actually sort of funny. Alright, right, let's go to the amphitheater, see if we can watch a play. Lothar Citadel, that's right there. I sure have spent a lot of gold here. Yes. Not a problem. What's the amphitheater used for? Depending on the climate, it has a number of uses. Plays, presentations, trials, and forth, though, so forth. Trials? Yes, like the one that occurred yesterday. I hope you haven't missed missed it. A sorceress from above named Isbola was accused of violating nature's order when Inquisitor Veneman offered her a good defense. We've not seen it yet. I mean, yes, we missed it. What happened? The issue of her guilt was discussed and evidence presented, but we adjourn because Veneman need to ask a few questions of Ambassador Jasper, who is away on business. From what I hear, Veneman has proved her innocence. Proven. What about that play? Yes, indeed. In fact, there's a little piece of fiction we've been working on that, that we'd love to share with you. We call it Eternal Flame. Interested? Why not? Most excellent. Let's see. Oh, yes, our tale begins 500 years ago in a land far, far away with that little shepherd boy named Hammond Rousey. Hmm, let's watch this play. This ought to be interesting, right? What a very interesting play. A couple of flame walkers just dancing around there, I guess. <sighs> the end. <laughs> We're all asleep. Hmm. <sighs> What's King Lothar doing? He looks like he's uh, up to no good. Looking around both ways. Oh! Oh, so King Lothar killed her. She wasn't trying to escape. Sneaky bastard. He's trying to incite a war, perhaps. These are great graphics. I mean, I kind of miss the 2D era somewhat. Why the hell does this guy keep attacking me? Journal. We agreed to see the Flame Walkers play. It must have been very long and boring as we slept through most of it into the night. Though somewhat groggy, we saw King Lothar indiscreetly rip High Sorceress Isabella from her cage and fatally toss her into the sea before returning to his abode. The Jaster's suspicions of foul play were justified. We awoke Venom and passed us in a hurry to get somewhere. Actually, he's not passing us in a hurry, he's attacking us. See if we can get out of here. Um, let's see. What if I can get to that Fields of Slaughter exit to advance the story at all?
more perils his domain is how to do that, I guess. At your command. Meanwhile, that guy's casting spells on me or something. Well, I guess I can talk to Lord Pyros. Um, so I can't, uh... I can't, like, tell him about King Lothar. Maybe I can... Oh, shit, I can't get out of here either, can I? What do I need to do now? I think the story might be broken. For some reason... Veneman is hostile on me. I wonder if I broke something somehow by getting him caught in an area of effect. I might have screwed that up. I sure hope not. I need to go talk to somebody here. My last autosave was when I entered this area. God, I hate to have another screw-up. I'm really getting sick of this area and having all these screw-ups. sick of this. Hmm. That did nothing. Maybe I have to go confront uh, King Lothar. Maybe that's the way to do it. Hmm. Now we can't even do that. To go to the guard post, I guess. Yes, King Lothar, you wish to see me? Ah, uh, Inquisitor Veneman, welcome. I'm afraid I have grave news. Your sorceress fell into the sea while trying to escape. What? Why would she do such a thing when Pyros ordered her release? I this much reached no other ear. Pyros, it is he who caused the eruption thirty years ago. As well as the one about to occur. In fact, when you left us earlier, he ordered Isbola's execution. I don't understand any of this. As part of the deal he made with Kasuth, Lord of Flame, to cleanse Dragon's Eye with fire every thirty years, regardless of its inhabitants. I am, of course, an immune, so it's a little consequence to me, but... Ah, so that's why he goes and kills Lord Pyros. How interesting. Oh, like an avalanche does my soul fall upon the ground. I, perhaps I'll request a private meeting with him in the morning. Maybe if he's off screen, he won't die of poison. What's this? Eavesdropping on my conversation? That was your last mistake. Hopefully he won't die. That the uh, Inquisitor Venom in that is. Hostile trolls. Can I get out here if I go there? Yes, I can. So all that need be done. is to survive this battle. Hopefully. Ready and willing. Oh, we've got these guys over here. Cone of cold on the king there. All my spells have worn off. Oh, that's because I went to that stupid play. Shit, I didn't notice that. 
That's not good. Let's get the cone of cold going there again. I listen. And meanwhile, let's finish off this troll. <laughs> King Lothar takes 61 damage. Let's mirror image ourselves up again. Let's go help out Adolf here. There we go. Why don't you heal him? Or better yet, go heal him, just in case. Glad everybody's stuck in this bottleneck. Hmm. The Efreet's dead. King Lothar is almost dead. Troll's, troll is badly wounded. I bet an ice dagger will finish him off. Ah. <sighs> King Lothar is still not dead, eh? I bet I can finish him off with these guys. Here we go. There we go, everybody's dead. Good riddance. Potion of explosions. That's a nice potion to have, I tell you. Hmm, found some gold. Somehow. Can't say because there are foes nearby. Oh yes, there are some over here. Just say the word. I see two. Let's see if there is anybody else in the citadel here. I am summoned. Yes. What would you have? Ah, yes. Enemy sighted. A hellhound. Another hellhound. Why don't we take care of that the best way we know how? Oh, thanks. Now, he was fucking invisible, right? Hide failed. Never mind. Shit. It's time to actually rebuff everybody. Since I uh, lost all my buffs during that play, but it was worth it.